In the dark alleys of London, in the year 1888, a series of gruesome murders shook the city to its core. The killer, known as Jack the Ripper, eluded capture and left a trail of terror in his wake. Even after all these years, the identity of this heinous murderer remains a mystery, shrouded in secrecy and the whispers of the dip. In this video, we delve deep into the ghastly tale of Jack the Ripper, unmasking the world's most infamous serial killer and unravelling the secrets behind his chilling crimes. Brace yourselves for the horrors that lie ahead will leave you trembling in fear. In the fall of 1888, the city of London was terrorized by a series of gruesome murders. The perpetrator, known as Jack the Ripper, was never caught, and the identity of the killer remains one of the most notorious mysteries in history. Let me take you back to August 31st, when the first body was discovered in the dingy streets of Whitechapel, a poor neighbourhood in East End London. The victim was a prostitute named Marian Nichols, and her body was found with her throat cut and her abdomen mutilated. The police were quick to realise that this was not a one-off event. In the coming months, several more women, all of them prostitutes, were found murdered in a similar manner. It was a gruesome pattern that left the entire city on edge. The city was gripped with fear and hysteria. The newspapers dubbed the killer Jack the Ripper, and the public demanded that the police catch him. But despite their best efforts, the killer remained at large. As the murders continued, various theories and suspects were put forward. Some believed that the killer was a doctor or a surgeon due to the precision of the mutilation. Others suggested that the killer was a member of the royal family or a high-ranking member of society who was covering up the murders. One of the most popular suspects was a man named Montague John Druitt, a barrister and teacher who had recently lost his job and was known to have mental health issues. He had also committed suicide shortly after the last known Ripper murder, leading some to believe that he was the killer. Another suspect was a Polish immigrant named Aaron Kosminski, who was known to be mentally unstable and had been committed to an asylum shortly after the murders. A shawl found at one of the crime scenes was believed to have belonged to one of the victims and contained DNA evidence that was thought to match Kosminski's. Despite these and many other theories and suspects, the identity of Jack the Ripper remains a mystery to this day. The case has spawned countless books, movies and TV shows, and continues to fascinate people around the world. Perhaps the most terrifying aspect of the Jack the Ripper case is that it remains unsolved. The killer could have been anyone from a respected member of society to a deranged lunatic. The fact that he was never caught only adds to the mystery and the fear that he could still be out there waiting to strike again. One of the most gruesome aspects of the Ripper murders was the fact that the killer took organs from his victims. Some theories suggest that the killer was motivated by a desire to obtain these organs for medical purposes, while others suggest that he was a sadist who derived pleasure from the act of mutilation itself. Jack the Ripper's childhood and upbringing have also been the subject of much speculation. Some have suggested that he was abused as a child, while others believe that he may have suffered from mental illness. 
There are even those who argue that Jack the Ripper was a woman disguised as a man, although this theory has been largely discredited. Despite the fact that the Ripper murders took place over 130 years ago, the case still holds a fascination for people all over the world. Jack the Ripper remains one of the most famous and enigmatic serial killers in history, and the mystery of his identity and motives continues to captivate people to this day. So why did Jack the Ripper stop killing? Some theories suggest that he died or was incarcerated, while others argue that he simply moved on to other parts of the world to continue his reign of terror. Whatever the truth may be, the legacy of Jack the Ripper lives on, and his story continues to chill and fascinate us to this day. As we delve deeper into the twisted mind of Jack the Ripper and explore the many theories surrounding his identity and motives, one thing is certain. The Ripper murders will remain one of the most enduring and horrifying mysteries in the annals of crime. As we come to the end of this ghastly tale, we're left with more questions than answers. Who was Jack the Ripper? Was he a respected member of society or a shadowy figure lurking in the dark alleyways of Whitechapel? We may never know for sure, but one thing is certain. Jack the Ripper will always be remembered as one of the most infamous serial killers in history. The terror he wrought on the streets of London continues to captivate and horrify us to this day. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more spine, tingling tales like this one, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And if you know someone who loves a good scare, be sure to share this video with them. Hit that like button and leave a comment below to let us know what you thought of the story. Until next time, sleep tight and watch out for the shadows.